Hello everyone, it's Chatter from the Poker Sweepers. Today I'm gonna do another random battle, maybe two of them, I don't know yet. Well, probably two of them because uh, I have a lot of time and it's easy and stuff. Thanks, same. GLHF uh, stands for good luck, have fun, in case you didn't know. Um, so he has a Flareon. Uh, he might have the Will O Wisp, and I don't want to take that, so. I don't really have anything to switch into, that's the problem. So let me go for a Dragon Tail. He actually goes for Flame Charge, raises some speed, that's good. Um, I do take it out with a crit, that's good. Um, minor combat's in the chat too, that's kind of funny. He asked me, he was like, hey, I'm gonna watch your battle while you're recording. I was like, okay, thanks, good. Um, so I took one of his Pokemon out. I am Choice Bandit, so, and Hostile as well, so I don't know if the crit mattered. Um, I still got kind of lucky with the accuracy check, seeing as how um, it's like 70% accuracy with Hostile and 90 base in mind. Um, so let me see, what can I do? I can switch into Lugia, take an Earthquake, and then go for an Ice Beam, maybe? Um, he actually goes for X Scissor, breaks my multi scale, it doesn't do a lot, but it's okay. Um, I think I can set up a substitute. Yes, I have that, so that's good. Um, I do not have hazard, so it won't be as effective to go for the uh, to go for the what do you call it? The whirlwind all the time, but I might have to later. Um, the ice beam does over half, which is good. So if I go for another one I could take it out. Um, he has the Alive Orb too, I can stall him out like that, but there's no real need to. So I'm just gonna go for another Ice Beam to take him out. Um, so that happens. Also, I'm battling Dark Dawn, in case you didn't see, or whatever. So yeah. Um, two of his Pokemon are down, which is good. All my Pokemon are alive. Look, yes, they kill him. I know. So, um, he has a Herd here, or she, whatever. And yeah, that's kind of annoying because of the Intimidate, even though I don't have a physical attack, so actually it does not really matter, but you can switch it in later at all my other physical attackers. So I, I'm gonna go into my Hitmonlee so I can um, attack it. Dark Dawn complains that he or she doesn't do have anything against the Lugia, but that's okay. Um, random battle is like that, so yeah. Um, Herdu goes for the Ice Fang, does quite some damage, but it's okay. Uh, I do have a Dark Gem, but I don't really care too much, because Fighting Gem is like better, or Normal Gem with Fake Out, but it's okay. Um, the Eye Jump Kick takes it out, which is good. So I think I could go for another one and do a lot of damage, if not take it out. Um, no, do not take it out, but it's okay. Scald will hopefully not get a burn, which it won't, which is good. So I can go for a Sucker Punch right now to take it out, which is gonna be uh, nice. Dark Gem powers it, so now my Unburdened Speed Boost is activated. Um, this battle seems really uh, in my favor, because uh, he has 2 left and I have 6 left, but the problem is Reshiram is a big threat that can do a lot of damage, but um, yeah, um, does not take me out, and I think I can still outspeed right now, but it, I can miss the high jump kick, that is a possibility. And I do not want to risk Sucker Punch not taking it out. So that happened. So this might be a 6-0, which would be pretty cool. Um, Unburden, in case the person didn't know. So there's an High Dragon left. Let me go for another High Jump Kick, take it out. So that will be the game. Um, thank you all for watching. Thank you Dark Dawn for playing. So let's go for another one. Okay, got a battle against Mach Gao Gammon or something. Um, I have a Shell Gone, he is a Beldum. Can't really touch that. Let's see if I have any fire moves. I have Flintthrower on my Zorark. Um, Krillowat, that's a Kapumon. Um, phew, what should I do? I think I can go into Zorark right off the bat. Don't really mind. So it pops up as a Weavile, which is really funny. Um, I can directly go for a flamethrower, but that will kind of give away the fact that I'm Zorark. So let me go for Nasty Plot, maybe he doesn't realize that I'm Zorark then. Um, he does go for an Iron Head, does under half luckily. Um, the Iron Defense does not matter, seeing as how I'm a special attacker rather than physical, which is good. Um, 
So flamethrower, he actually has the focus sash, which is annoying for me. Um, and I have the life orb, so he can take me out with another iron head. That's a little bit unfortunate for me. So I, I don't want to use my Krillowat, so there's that. So right now I'm going to go into my actual Weavile. And I'm going to take it out with an Ice Shard. Actually, Night Slash is better because I outspeed anyways. So there's that. And if he would have switched, that would probably um, be more beneficial to me. But he did not switch. Uh, doesn't matter. I also got a useless crit there. Um, I don't feel too worried going for a low kick. will probably do a lot. Uh, it did. It did way over half. I do get some recoil. And he gets up Stealth Rocks. Now, nothing on my team really minds the Stealth Rock. So, I guess that's okay. Um, he goes for the Protect just to kind of stall it out. Maybe he wants just to... Maybe he thought I would switch or something. See what that would do. Or maybe... He thought I would have another move, but no, it's not like that. So, um, he plays smart by switching into Weezing, which doesn't take any damage, like almost no damage from that move. So, right now I'm going to switch into my Shell Gun and try to um, Dragon Dance up. But he might have the Will-O-Wisp, so that's going to be annoying. Um, he actually does have it, which is annoying, but um, I can deal with it. I mean, I can set up one Dragon Dance and then Outrage or something. He actually has the clear smog and it got a crit too. So I'm quite much forced to attack right now. I think it will do a little bit under half, but it's okay. Um, if I do outspeed, uh, which I do. So it doesn't do it doesn't do a lot, which is just bad. But the good thing is I can get a safe switch in into my Starmie and then go for a uh, psychic or anything really. But he might uh, he might switch into a Ferrothorn predicting that. I am choice scarfed, so tricking a scarf onto anything will be pretty good for me. So right now I do have the black sludge, which is annoying, but okay, he is scarfed. He goes for the clear smog. I have no poison types to block that, unfortunately. So what I am gonna do is go for one recover, and then I'm gonna get, then I'm going to attack him. So I do have about half HP because of the black sludge and all the clear smogs. Now I want to trick the black sludge off later because it's annoying and I want something else. So he does switch into Ferrothorn right now, that's a smart play. So right now I'm gonna go for, ooh this is a little bit bad, ooh what should I do? I'm actually gonna switch into my Sunflora, like I wanted to go for Trick but maybe he predicted that switches back into uh, Weavile, but he actually does go for Lichie, pretty good play. Um, I couldn't have uh, attacked him anyways, uh, so there's that. Right now I'm gonna go for the sunny day because I have no water moves on my team anyways. So that's gonna be okay. Um, he does go for protect, so that's really good for me, getting a sunny day off at the protect. That's just excellent, he just kind of wasted a turn there. But I guess it's okay. Right now I'm gonna go for the hidden power fire. We'll hit quite much anything. Um, Embor comes in, takes a little bit of damage but not too much. So right now I'm gonna go for an earthquake. Um, Earth Power, I hope it will take it out, but it does not. So he's gonna finish me off. No, he misses the Fire Blast. Wow. That's quite unfortunate for him, but... You know, hacks happened. So I do wanna go for another move. Actually, Solar Beam and Earth Power have the same... No, it's half because it resists. So I cannot risk anything, so I have to go for the Earth Power. But of course, he does switch into Weezing. Um, was a little predictable but there was really nothing I could do so this thing is choice scarfed um, he does choice scarf himself into clear smog pretty uh, obvious that he would do that but it's okay so right now I can go for another I'm actually gonna go for a solar beam here because I think it will do more and if not that's gonna be stupid for me um, I might take it out I don't know um, I do which is good because of the stab bonus and all that stuff so that's pretty good so he does have a Porygon Z so I can fire off one last solar beam but actually I am slower which is bad because I had the chlorophyll and all that stuff so I think I have to switch in my fake mon, my Krillowat, whatever the hell that is oh it has magic guard, okay that's good so I can go for a mirror, mirror coat well he might attack me, that would be awesome if not, it's going to be bad. Um, yes, he does actually switch, so that's um, unfortunate for me. Now, I have no clue what Krillowat's what stats are or anything. 
So I'm just gonna go for an Ice Beam. It's not Stab, but it's okay, I guess. Uh, it does do a bit, but not too much. So he does have the Leech Seed. Um, the Protect is gonna be very obvious, so I'm gonna switch into my Weavile. Um, what the fuck is that? It's a Capmon. Kinda reminds me of Capcom, lol. <laughs> Anyways, um, shall I go for Swords Dance or Low Kick? I think I'm gonna go for Low Kick right off the bat. I do take that out, that's really good for me. Um, that threat's out of the way, but still, it's kind of GG already, I think. I mean, I don't know what his last Pokemon would be, but Porygon Z can quite much outspeed and kill my entire team, I think. But I'm not too, too sure about that. Uh, now, do I need this Weavile? Um, no, because of the um, Stealth Rocks, I cannot switch it back in. So, he goes for the Tri-Attack, finishes me off, it's kind of unfortunate, but it's okay can deal with that. Um, I'm gonna switch into Krillowat right now. Um, I'm gonna go for a Thunderbolt, it will hit anything on his team. Uh, Embor, it will kill Embor I think. And he actually has a Piloswine to block it, so that's just really unfortunate for me. There's no way I could have predicted that, so there's that. Um, so I have nothing to do. Like he got, He's gonna go for an Earthquake and take me out or something, I just know it. So I'm gonna go for an Ice Beam, will probably not do anything at all. So it goes for an Earthquake, almost takes me out. So I think that's GG, unless I can, he does something stupid or something. Crit Earthquake doesn't even do half. That's just silly. So, um, Starmie, yes, that's the only thing I have remaining, but Porygon Z will outspeed me and take me out, so that will be the game, I think. See, even Psychic does not take this thing out, well, he can take me out. So that's good game, Magguama, go a gammon or something. Um, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And leave a like, comments always nice. So thank you for watching and later.